how would you rate our kiss from last night? Look who decided to join us. All right. You all know the drill. Run your routes. Lock your logbooks. You run into anything you can't handle. Uh, Ellie! You have no idea what you're walking into. What are you doing? You don't know how large that group is. How armed. I don't care.
Some say he died on the beach. Others say he is a storm made to flesh. When the wind thrashes their tents and boats, they know he is coming. Tell him I'm coming.
was over. The old guard was wiped out. Those who kneeled were now at the gates of hell. They were killing us off, burning our seas from shore to shore. We thought there was no way the Empire could win this game. As fate would have it, the tide turned in our favor again. A new wind was at our backs, blowing us straight to heaven. In our new Eden, there was only one rule. First come, first serve. It was dog eat dog. We became kings, queens, lords and masters of our own new worlds. Fortunes poured down on us. They had their empire. Welcome to the Cyberpunk 2077 2019 Deep Dive video. In last year's gameplay reveal, we showed you our vision for the world of Cyberpunk 2077, its quests, and visual design. This year, we'd like to give you a peek at some of the play styles you'll be able to adopt as your character progresses through the story. Here goes nothing. You're about to see sequences embodying two distinct approaches to playing Cyberpunk. 
We'll show you a strong solo build, that is, a character who focuses on employing blunt force and taking instant action. And a Netrunner build, a playstyle taking frequent advantage of stealth tactics, hacking, and battlefield control achieved using malicious software. Additionally, you'll learn more about Pacifica, one of the game's districts. Two gangs, the Animals and the Voodoo Boys. And you'll see glimpses of Johnny Silverhand, the digital construct who haunts our main character, V. A word of caution. Given that the video covers a section of the game deep into the main storyline, we have edited the footage to contain as few spoilers as possible. Be aware that the gameplay as presented does reveal characters and locations you'll see while playing the game's main story arc. So watch at your own discretion. Where are we headed? As Polaris's campaign promised, This way. In this video, you'll experience a segment of a quest from the middle of the game. We're currently in Pacifica, one of Night City's six unique districts. You know Pacifica well? Nah. You guys aren't exactly great at rolling out the welcome mat for outsiders. It was designed to be a tourist hotspot within the city. As you can see, this didn't pan out. When uncertainty struck the global economy, investors pulled their funding, leaving most establishments unfinished. It's one of those places where expectations and reality collided, resulting in a heap of disappointment. Ongoing gang wars plague this part of the city. Outsiders don't come here if they don't have to. Even by Night City standards, it's dangerous to those unfamiliar with it. Taking a casual stroll here would not be a good idea. A fast motorbike or armor-plated car would be the safer option. But places like this have their advantages. If you're in need of rare goods or illegal cyberware, Pacifica's bustling local markets are a good place to start your search. The Grand Imperial Mall is a whole other... We're in the central part of the city, so-called District 2. The city is made up of seven very different regions, and each one is a truly individual environment that introduces new parkour moves, enemies, and gameplay mechanics. Eight. Hey. What, are you not going? Oh, there's a lot of them down there. Things will get fucked up at the castle, I guarantee it. You got a plan B? I'll improvise. What if he improvises? It'll work out. 
You so sure about that? Frank! Fuck! Knew it! Weapon modding makes a comeback in Dying Light 2. We have a modded weapon. So now, let's find a good moment to use it. They will be free. You get after those fuckers. I'll look after him. What happened? What happened? Those fucking renegades shot him. Where were you? <laughs> hey, hey, hold still. Hey, hey, catch that truck, or you would never get onto that alley. The first choice: chase the truck or stay with Frank. Just keep him alive. Stay in contact. Now run! Damn it! Run! Hold on, Frank. Okay, let's chase the truck and see what consequences that brings. The truck is gone, but this tall building looks like a great vantage point. We should use it. As you can see, life is booming on the rooftops, and this is something you can change by your actions and decisions. Hey, have you found the truck yet? Not yet. Matt? Can you see the truck? Looking us, Frank. Can't find the doctor. But don't think about that now. I'm on it. That's the Renegade's truck. I have it. I'll get them for this, Matt. Just keep your cool, kid. Remember. Vicious terror attack left hundreds dead. Mayor of London has declared a state of emergency. As you can see, London's having a rough time of it. What with these nasty opportunists seizing control. That's where you come in. Welcome to the Resistance. It's up to you to build the perfect team and take the city back. The good news is that any Londoner could become your next recruit. You can play as anyone. And they've all got their own gameplay skills. See this charming chappy? That's Victor. Watch it, you dumb idiot. He only takes half the amount of damage after his nectar pint. Or four. <laughs> Top man! And her, that's Sue, top-notch lawyer. Once in your team, she can get your operatives out of jail automatically. You don't even need to lift a finger. Nice one, Sue. And this is Alan, old codger and veritable mad bastard. Increased damage with rifles and, wait, may die randomly? R.I.P. Alan. Moving on. Everyone is different, so you have to decide what's best for your team. But why would these fine people want to join you? Well, everyone's got an origin story. I want you to help me get revenge on the gangster f that killed my brother. Help them with their problem, and once they trust you, they will become playable characters. Each one of your new best friends is a unique gameplay build. So dust off your sorting hat and give them a class. Then level them up and unlock new perks. There are thousands of possibilities. Whether you've got a knack for gizmos, or you'd rather stalk people from the shadows, building a team with diverse skills will be critical to your success. Each new recruit will make your team stronger. You can even customise your team members. There, what a lovely hat. Of course, accidents can happen. Don't worry. If you're smart, you could always surrender. No shame in that. 
Anyone got Sue's number? Luckily, our city is filled with millions of people, and any single one of them could be your next recruit. You're doing good. I'm doing great. London's calling. Get out there and take it back.